Questions and comments? Questions et commentaires? The Honourable Member for New Westminster, Burnaby. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Madam Speaker. And uh, I appreciate the member opposite. He lives in the Lower Mainland. I, I am sure that he is as aware as I am and other Lower Mainland MPs are of the depth and breadth of the crisis that is taking place right now. Every day, two people die in the Lower Mainland. We know in Ontario, every day, Two people die in Alberta. Every day a person dies. This is a health crisis of unimaginable uh, uh, e an extent that is, is something that should be uh, calling the government to take immediate action. And instead, Madam Speaker, what we saw is over a year the government just dragged its feet, refused to do anything as the death toll rose, uh, doubling, tripling. We're now talking about thousands of Canadians dying over the past couple of years. And so, Madam Speaker, the, the, the implications are enormous if nothing much happens. The government has moved very slowly on this legislation, waited now over a year, 15 months now. We're coming up to February tomorrow. They, they took office and could have moved something in December of 2015. And they've done nothing really to, uh, in, in any way, fight uh, to put in place the addiction treatment programs that are needed across the country, and they have refused to call a public health emergency. So my question to the member is, why is the government moving so dreadfully slowly in the midst of this crisis? 